It's harvest day for local farmer Johnny Darlington and volunteers from the Lagos Food Bank initiative are here to purchase produce he might not be able to sell. It's all part of a program started by the Food Bank last year to curb farmers' losses and direct otherwise wasted food to hungry people. The road is bad and um, before we get our goods out, some go bad. The distance to the market as well. For instance, where I am now, Hawawo, down to Lagos, passing through it for road, is very, very terrible. So imagine having to wait or break down. Experts estimate that 40% of all food produced in Nigeria is lost, wasted or spoiled. Poor road infrastructure, the high cost of transportation and improper storage facilities for rural farmers are to blame. That's where the Lagos Food Bank comes in. From the farm, the produce is taken to a storage facility where it's cleaned, sorted and prepared for distribution. This week, hundreds of vulnerable people in this Lagos slum benefited from the initiative's free meals or what they call the Box of Hope. I feel happy. I feel very happy. I appreciate what you have done for us. I can't describe how I feel unless you get into my heart. You people who have done this don't want us to beg for food. God will continue to help them so that they'll keep coming. I pray this won't be their last. This intervention is timely. Nigeria is struggling with its worst cost of living crisis in decades, exacerbated by unpopular government reforms, including the scrapping of the petrol subsidy. The United Nations estimates 31 million people will be food insecure between June and September this year, the so-called lean season. Michael Sunbola is the executive director of the Lagos Food Bank. There's a lot of food gap in our society, and the fact that um, at least more than 63.3% of our population are multidimensionally poor, and the fact that a whole lot of people still struggle to find their meet their um, daily needs and also fend for themselves and you know and feed, and we have to um, you know come up with very creative ways to solve some of these pressing problems. Sunbala says the group has served more than two million people in 170 communities so far. Last week, President Bola Tinubu said he was aware of the challenges triggered by his reforms, but said the reforms will create a better economic future for Nigerians. Initiatives like the Lagos Food Bank aim to help millions of vulnerable people keep from going hungry until that future arrives. Timothy Obiezu, VOA News, Lagos, Nigeria.